Good morning, everybody, on this Friday, October 11th. Sorry, I'm trying to log on to my work computer at the same time that I'm trying to open a vlog. Um, it's asking for my password a second time, which sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Today, it decided it was going to ask for my password a second time. So, anyhow, um, good morning. It's Friday. Favorite day of the week. Don't mind my lip. It's healing. It's actually almost gone. Um, I hate it that it always looks the worst right before it's healed. You know what I mean? Why does it do that? Why does it look the worst before it heals? But that's just the way it is. So it's going to be gone in a couple more days. It'll be gone. Anyway, it's Friday, the favorite day of the week. Tonight we thought it was going to be John's school versus Nick's school on football. It is not. I think that's actually next week or the week after. Both of our teams are home tonight. Um, they're playing different schools, not each other. So I don't know that we're going to go do that tonight. Um, I want to go see a movie this weekend. I don't know if we're going to get to it because tomorrow I th think we're going to go to the orchard um, to get some apples. Maybe. We'll see. Um, but I'm thinking that we might do that. We might go to the orchard and get some apples tomorrow because Neil works 12 to 5. Why he works 12 to 5? I don't know. It's the middle of the day. The store manager had some hours, I guess, and he just gave Neil some hours for the middle of the day to eat up hours. I don't know. But Neil works 12 to 5. So I would I would like to go to a movie, like, because of their cheaper in the matinee prices, which is, like, midday. Um, but if Neil wants to go see the movie with us, uh, we might just go in the evening. We'll see. That's That's healing, too. And this one's almost gone. I always have blemishes on my face. I always look a terrible mess. Anyhow. Um, so I, I think we're going to go to the orchard tomorrow. And I think we we might go to a movie tomorrow night. That's a big might. Um, I just don't like going to movies in the evenings. They're usually more crowded. They're more expensive. And for four of us to go. Yeah. I might look at Neil's schedule for next week. Maybe we'll go next Saturday. I think he got it already. I think he already gave it to me. I think I hung it up, but I don't remember what he worked. Maybe he were, he might work 1 to 10 next Saturday. See, we can't go to a matinee show with Neil unless he works like 4 to 10, which sometimes he does. Um, I got to schedule a uh, massage. I don't know if I told you guys the place that John bought the... He bought a 30-minute. I found out. They, they called me back. He bought me a 30-minute massage in March of 2018. <laughs> They were like, well, we usually only allow them for a year, but if you use it before the end of this calendar year, we'll let you come in. So I'm going to schedule that. I'm going to try to schedule that for the same day that I'm getting my hair done, which is the 1st of November. Um, my hair points at 1230. I'm going to try to get the massage for like 10. And then I'm going to try to get our Christmas picture scheduled for that evening. Um, yeah, that's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to tell Neil to make sure that he doesn't work that that evening. And I'm going to try to get him scheduled for like 5 5:30 ish somewhere in there my hair will be long done before then but um yeah my boss is supposed to be getting oral surgery today and he is online right now there's something seriously wrong with that man he's crazy i would not do that no way if i'm getting surgery no the day that i'm going and getting my massage and my christmas pictures and my hair done I am not going to be online. You can forget it. No one is going to get me online unless like the whole freaking every system that I own dies. My deputy, my project managers, they can handle it. They're 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 good. They don't need they don't need me. <laughs> I don't know why the heck he's online. Anywho, I'm getting online right now. I will see you all later. I'm going to make my um, videos live for every beauty film on Omni Zeet. Um, I just have to throw together the thumbnails. That's going to take me like a minute each uh, because I, the, the, um, it's a box unboxing on OmniZeet and it's my foundation review on uh, Evie Beauty Fail. So I kind of have like templates that I use there. So anyhow, I will see you guys later on today. Bye. All right, you guys, it's moving right along today. It's 645. I didn't realize it was this late. Um, I worked until like 5.30. My employee's trying to get me in trouble. She's doing things she shouldn't be doing. She's just running amok. Anyway, I worked until 5.30 on a Friday. Yes, I did.
it's just the way it is anyway i did start late though i think i told you this morning i started at 8 30 so i just did have to work until five o'clock anyway so it's not like i worked that late today but um then i had gotten my boxy charm so i just unboxed that and this is what i ended up looking like i don't i don't know i'm about to unbox the keto crate with john i just got to get him up here with my water because lord knows i need some water i haven't drank enough water this afternoon i'm feeling very dehydrated and usually if i'm feeling dehydrated that means i'm like way beyond dehydrated i should have drank like a long time ago um but i don't know that i'm gonna eat dinner i'm not hungry <laughs> Um, I know I probably have to eat dinner because I only ate, I haven't been hungry today, like period, I haven't been hungry today. I wasn't hungry for breakfast and I was hungry at lunch and I ate 750 calories. So yeah, um, I'm just not real hungry tonight. And my concern, what I told John was. One of my issues is that once I start eating, like I trigger that response in my body. So if I start eating, I'm gonna wanna eat like everything under the sun. Right now, I'm not hungry. I could go to bed without eating dinner and I might actually do that. Um, but if I start eating, I don't know that I'm gonna be able to stop eating. Um, I might end up eating a thousand calories if I start eating and I don't really want I don't really want to do that <laughs> so we are going to open the keto crate and there will be some things that we taste test in here so i will be eating that thing those things um but i don't know that i'm gonna eat anything else we'll see we'll see anyway i actually have to turn the air conditioner on in here because it got hot because the afternoon sun comes in that window and it just heats the room up by the time i turned the air conditioner on it was 82 degrees in here yeah so i think john and nicholas ate burgers for dinner i think they ate burgers for dinner so anyway i wanted to check in with you guys before it was too late i will probably check in again when i'm taking my makeup off which will be right after we unbox the keto crate so I'm going to put this camera down, I'm going to turn that camera on, and get this unboxed, and then I will probably take my makeup off, and I will talk to you then. Alright you guys, I'm ready to take my makeup off. It is now 7.20. We opened our Keto Crate box. I'm going to try not to talk with my mouth open too much, because I know I still have like stuff in my teeth, and I apologize for that. Um, so if you see anything, I'm sorry. That's probably too much information, but I just wanted to warn you. Um... I did end up eating an entire bar, so I got some calories in that way, 240 calories, whoops, yeah, like that, 240 calories, so I did get some calories in, and then I got some, you know, other calories, we, we ended up eating, I think we only opened two things, we didn't open a lot today, two or three, I think, oh no, three, we did open three things. The bar, which which I ate all but like one bite of, a uh, little snack thingy, which was good, and then like protein puffs. And I only know that we opened three things because we've got three wrappers sitting here. So anyway, I'm gonna take my makeup off even though I just put it on, but that's okay, I don't mind. In fact, you know, this was the plan. Um, we're gonna go, I think, for a Pokemon run. Like I said, it's 7.22. I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm gonna eat anything else tonight. Um, yeah i just i'm not hungry you know and I'm, I'm not gonna force myself to eat just because i'm just not gonna eat anything else so if i eat anything else i'm probably just gonna eat like a protein bar or maybe a fat bomb or something um anyhow what i might do is make some fat bombs um we are going to go for a Pokemon run. We're going to buy lottery tickets, I think, as well while we're out. And like I said, these, these wipes are okay. They do not a bad job, but they're not as good as the Cogenda ones. It could also depend on the uh, foundation I have because different foundations are like um, different foundations stick to your skin in different ways. But 
We're going to go get lottery tickets. I think I'm probably going to go to Rite Aid for that because it is friends and family weekend this weekend, which means 30% off. And we actually got a coupon in our email, not just because we're related to an employee, but um, I always I buy my deodorant, which is a natural deodorant, from Rite Aid. And it's not inexpensive. Rite Aid is an expensive place. I found it occasionally at TJ Maxx. When I say occasionally, I mean like literally like twice. Um, they have other scents that I found at TJ Maxx more so than the scent that I use. But And I use the roll-on one and they have solids and that's the one I find more often at TJ Maxx than the roll-on. So... I uh, end up buying it at Rite Aid and I, I usually pick up like two or three every time they have this 30% off sale because I do usually use like, I usually go through an entire uh, roll on each month. So I have some on backup in my closet in my bathroom and um, like I said I usually pick up like two or three every time I they have this 30% off sale because they do it like, I don't know, maybe quarterly. I thought they normally did it closer to the, to Christmas, but I guess not. The one thing that I think is kind of stinky though is like, okay, so I used to work in retail. I worked uh, at TJ Maxx for a very long time. I worked at TJ Maxx for like 11 years from 16 to 27. I quit when I had Nick, so I maybe 28. It must have been 12 years. Anyway, I worked at TJ Maxx for 12 years, and then when I had Nick, I went to work at Walmart because TJ Maxx would not give me a transfer to the store in my town, which is what I wanted, and they wouldn't do it because the lady who was my manager didn't like me, so she would not approve me to transfer. So. I quit TJ Maxx, went to work for Walmart, believe it or not. I made it at Walmart for an entire, like, month before I quit. I just couldn't do it. So I quit Walmart and went to work for Target. And I ended up working for Target for, like, almost a year. And I ended up quitting Target because I got a promotion at work. And honestly, I couldn't keep working and, like, closing the store, just closing Target, like, 10 o'clock at night. And then getting up the next morning and going to work. I just couldn't. I, I just couldn't stay on top of that. So... Yeah, but where I was going with this was that I, I did work at retail for a very long time, like 13 years of my life I worked in retail, and there's pros and cons to it, but um, every store I've worked at, like I said, I've worked at three different stores, always gave you the discount on everything you bought, regardless of if it was on sale, on clearance, it didn't matter. Rite Aid, as an employee, your employee discount only works if it's not discounted. So like Rite Aid does a lot of sales, like buy one, get one 50% off, or buy one and get one, f and then don't do buy one, get one free, or like 20% off your purchase, or you know, whatever. They do a lot of sales. Or 20% off like this eyeshadow palette. Um, your employee discount does not hit on top of the sale. So, you know, if, if you're buying a bottle of water and it's 99 cents down from $1.29, you don't get 99 cents plus 10% off or 20%. I forget what he gets. I think he gets 10% off. Whatever. I don't remember. I don't buy a lot of stuff at Rite Aid other than my prescriptions. Um, I will buy makeup there when I buy drugstore makeup. I'm kind of like really not buying a lot of makeup, to be honest with you. And I might do a complete no buy during... Uh, 2020 unless there's something that like really catches my eye um, I might I mean I'm still probably gonna get my beauty boxes but other than that like do a complete no buy other than if something like really catches my eye because I'm considering stopping doing the foundation reviews too because I just have so many foundations <laughs> and I'll, I only have one face and I don't know anybody else who's my skin tone so I, I mean they're, they're just never gonna get used you know so anyway we're gonna go do that run I got my makeup off. I will see you guys later on tonight. Bye. All right, y'all. It is 10 o'clock. 
We are about to watch a movie. I just finished watching the Shane Dawson video, um, The Dangerous Life of Jeffree Star, where they're talking about like Shane had a controversy and Jeffree had a uh, theft and stuff like that. So I just finished watching that. It's 10 o'clock. We're about to watch a movie. And by the time it's done, it's going to be almost midnight. So I have a feeling that I will forget to close out the vlog. So I wanted to do it right now. Um, yeah, it was a good video. It makes me wish that I would do more. I know that probably sounds crazy, but I do. I wish I would do more. I wish I could do more. I don't know. Maybe someday. Yeah. I actually have considered starting my own makeup company, but you know, like there was a lady in New Jersey who started Judia's place. Um, I don't know. I'm not a good marketer, you know. I wish I knew how to do that. Anyway, my brain's all over the place right now. Anyway, today I am thankful. I'm thankful it is Friday. We're gonna go watch a movie. I hope today was better than yesterday, and I hope tomorrow will be just a little better than today. I hope y'all are having a great day, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye, y'all.